so when we are talking about area of rhombus before that what is a rhombus anyone so i think it's like a kite i need a specific answer see we have done quadrilateral chapter like a kite is not a good answer what about others there are two parallel sides and uh, i mean two pairs of parallel sides okay sana what do you what do you like to add um it's a parallelogram to it's a parallelogram yeah i mean it comes under the category of parallelograms very good so how do you differentiate it from a parallelogram uh its sides its two parallel sides are equal in length yeah it's okay so this so what you are trying to say it is a kind of a parallelogram but in a parallelogram opposite sides are equal but in rhombus rhombus is a special kind of parallelogram where all sides are equal is it making sense everyone how do you say this thing rhombus is a kind of parallelogram where all sides are equal yes no making sense yes sir yes there is one special property of a parallelogram very special property anyone would like to say okay i'll give you a hint it is related to the diagonals See, unless and until you don't remember the properties, it is difficult to remember the formulas also. Quickly, what is that special thing? So on that note, I guess I need to take a test of quadrilaterals. Okay, in upcoming week, today is what? Today is Wednesday. Saturday or Sunday, I'll take a test of chapter quadrilateral. Now, the pro special property is diagonal bisect each other. So this part is equal to this part. This part is equal to this part, and it is at ninety degree. Is it making sense? Now, if you pay attention. what is this shape what is this shape so that's a nice horseless triangle yeah. okay let's call it a triangle but isosceles triangle is a good word yeah a b c okay right now what i'm doing i'm de deriving the formula i can give you the formula like this only okay in the beginning only but i want you to think critically and this is 90 degree let me just mark it as point o what is the formula of area of triangle vibhu what is the area of triangle formula half bracket open base into right base what is base over here sir cb D B, sorry A D B, sorry sorry sir, this should be D. A D B, this is base. Okay. So into um A O, that's the height. A O, very good. Now. If I take another color, 
Sana, can you find the area of this particular triangle first? C D B. Isn't it? This is a triangle. Yes. What is so it? So it will be one by two mm -hmm. into um D B and C O. C O. So to find the area of the whole rhombus, what should I do? What should I do quickly? I should add half into db into ao plus half into db into co. If you pay attention and if you have done algebra, I have I know we have done half db half db is common. Can I take common half db? What will be remaining over here? AO plus CO. Is it making sense? Say yes, no. Yes, sir. Okay. In the figure, if you pay attention, AO is this part and CO is this part. If I add them, what will will I get? Yes, Aaron, what will I get? So you'll get um AO plus AO. So you'll get the length of that diagonal. Yes, AC. Can I say that? Yeah, AC. So that is the formula. And you just said it. Area of rhombus is half into diagonal one into diagonal two. Making sense? Can you see that DB is this diagonal? AC is this diagonal. Area of area of rhombus is half into half times. Diagonal one and diagonal two. That's how we say. Any doubt in this? Did you understand the derivation? Sana? Yes, I understood. Okay. Based on this. As you can see, this question number five, it's so easy. Do this question right now. Okay, question number five, after copying the formula. Yes, 